My name is Dr. Stephen Conti. I'm an orthopedic foot and ankle surgeon. Bunions are a misalignment of the great toe. Now bunion in Latin actually means turnip, which refers to the prominence that people see on their big toe. But you have to understand that is not extra bone. That's a misalignment of the great toe joint. And it's because of that misalignment that patients get symptoms. The treatment for bunion is dramatically different nowadays than it was even five years ago. And the reason is because our concept of bunion has changed. So if we believe that a bunion is a misaligned joint that's becoming arthritic with each step, then you can understand how taking pressure off the bump with a wider shoe is not really gonna change your long-term outcome, nor is the bunion splint that you buy in the magazine, which pulls the toe over but doesn't realign those little sesamoid bones. And so while we don't treat bunions that don't hurt because we can't make it any better than not hurting, any bunion that becomes consistently sore is a candidate for surgical treatment. But this is one of those diseases where early recognition of the bunion, early discussion, and sometimes non-surgical care is key. Surgery for bunions is evolving with our understanding of bunions. And so now that we don't think it's just a lump, we go to realign the bone. And that almost always involves cutting the bone in some way or fashion. If we cut a bone, we've created a fracture that we then need six to eight weeks to heal. We ask patients to elevate for a week to 10 days because the foot's had surgery, it's going to swell. And then they can immediately put weight on their foot on the heel in the post-op shoe. After about six or eight weeks, they begin to weight bear, but patients just have to understand it may be three or four months until they're in a shoe fully doing their activities and up to one year until they're fully recovered.